All right, so we got Lance, the road manager of Vince Van Great. Vince Van Great, the artist that just performed. He goes in a little bit. Uh, so yeah, they're both from Milwaukee, and they're down here in the morning. They just did that show. It was a beautiful show. Uh, I was going to ask them, what, so what do you guys think about that, all that stuff going on in Milwaukee uh, with the riots and all that? Or not really riots, but the protests. Okay. Well, as far as I'm going to say, it's good and bad. Mm -hmm. As far as if I can elaborate on the good, it brought people together, or it brought the people together yeah. a little bit, but they did bad things. Yeah. Like, I feel like they didn't go after the people who are doing the bad things. Mm -hmm. As far but. What, what do you mean by that? As far as they did vandalism and bomb places that didn't have nothing to do with anything. Yeah. These are people that just own regular businesses. They're regular people just like they were. Mm -hmm. But as far as they did stuff in the area where they bypassed yeah, the police station where the police are the ones that's actually doing the stuff that we were protesting about. Yeah. So well, that's why I felt like it was it was good and it was negative. Like, granted, I don't want to see innocent people get hurt, but yeah. if you're going to do something, go to where the people doing it is coming from. Yeah. Like, I, how is and, we, and our government today, if somebody come from another country come do something to us, we're going to that country to do something to them. Yeah. So why would you do something to them? We're not going to the side co countries. We're going to that country. Yeah. So it got to be on the balance level, and it wasn't that. Yeah. They took it out on whoever they want to take it out on. Whether it was good or bad. Yeah, and that's a common thing I hear, like even with the Chicago stuff going on, they say just because people they get so frustrated that they end up tearing up their own neighborhood just because, you know, out of that frustration. And they don't know who to take it out on. You know. Well, that, they go against the cop, they'll get locked that, up. I'm gonna say it like this. We don't look at statistics, but they say black on black crime is the reason our our society is how it is, but it's yeah. more white on white crime than it is black on black crime. Yeah. So we can we we do stuff that we want to do and everybody does, but we just got to get better at it and all. But everybody need to come together. Yeah. Like definitely. America need to be one. Yeah. Like under one liberty, we ain't that right now. Mm -hmm. And uh, Vincent Van Great. So what did you think about this whole Milwaukee, uh, the protests and all that stuff going on from your, you know, where you're from? Kind of to piggyback off what Lance was saying. You know, it's. Everybody had different opinions and different feelings about it, but I feel like, you know, cops, law enforcement, they kill someone's loved one. Yeah. So I understand that it's, you know, you kill my brother, it's wartime. Mm -hmm. But do it more strategically. Do it, do something that's gonna better the community. Fight yeah. back that way. Don't burn down the local gas station where you get gas and snacks and yeah. all type of other things from. Don't burn down a beauty supply store where your mom gets a hair or your mom does shopping at it and your mom goes there for items that brings joy to her life. You know mm -hmm. what I mean? Even though it's a small thing, but like to piggyback off what he said, they just did it the wrong way. And I feel like, you know, everything and everyone needs to come together and, you know, Stop all the senseless violence and the bullshit, man. John? All right, we also got John, also from Milwaukee. Okay. Uh, the drummer. He was, yeah, he was actually the drummer. Uh, I got it on a different video from the performance. Uh, so do you have any opinion on the whole Milwaukee, uh, the, the protests and everything going on where you're from? I basically agree with this, you know, like, it's not productive to the situation if you inconvenience the community. You know, if you do different things to inconvenience and impact your community in a negative way, so uh, it's not going to do anything but make the situation worse. Like, why go and burn down gas stations? You know, burn down African American homes? Yeah. Stuff like that. Why would you tear down the African American homes? You understand the frustration though, right? I do like, understand the frustration, you know, you know there's, there's two the reactions going on. Yeah. And I understand how you feel mad and how you feel frustrated. Because you got you know, your friend just passed away be due to an officer. You know, the officer didn't have to. All, every officer is trained to shoot without killing. They're trained, they have to go through that training. Yeah. Even deemed officer, even their badge. So therefore, 
there is so much room to be mad and to have frustration. I understand that, but at the same time, why go and cause frustration in the community? Yeah. That's not what I'm talking about. What is that energy? It's not. There's, there's a lot of things you can do. You can protest peacefully. You can, you know, there's different ways that our people in general have protested and done many things for the result of peace and equality and stuff like that. So basically, yeah. just the fact that now all of a sudden people want to go the negative route. Yeah, and, and tear up the whole neighborhood. Right, like, tear up the whole neighborhood. Okay. I mean, like we can't even walk. Like I literally can't walk the streets. Certain streets I walk because it's certain things that are still going down. Yeah. As we speak. Yeah. Certain people that are still going some way still feel like they should be mad about it. Continue to go. Yeah. But you know, it's, it's it is what it is, man. We just gotta keep going. We gotta keep it pushing. You know, can't let that stuff stop what we're doing. You know. Yeah. All right. Well, thank you. Uh, you know, I just I always wanted to get a little. I wanted to get that reaction from Milwaukee. I actually thought I was going to drive up there, but you know, you guys happen to be down here, so uh, thank you guys for that. No All right.